Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Cassandra and today I did this easy look on a bronze sparkly eye. So if you guys think this look is pretty then please keep on watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. Okay guys, so to get started with this look I'm going to first start with my foundation. I'm just going to go in with the Lancome foundation in the shade Buff. Concealer, the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light. This concealer has really good coverage and it's so creamy. I'm just going to blend it in with the Beauty Blender again. And I like to put it over my eyelids as well to prep for eyeshadow. Next I'm going to set with my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder with the Real Techniques Setting Brush. I'm going to set the rest of my face with my Pro Airbrush number 55 from Sephora. I'm hoping that the quality of this video is um, a lot better than the last one. I just bought a new camera. So hopefully the lighting is better and everything. Now that I'm all set, I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows real fast, so I will fast forward this part. Okay, brows are done. And then next we're going to go on to the eyeshadow look. Today I'm doing a super easy sparkly bronze look. So I'm just going to go into the Carly Bible palette and put in some transition shades into the crease just to get the look started. Okay, and I'm just going to do the same thing to the other eye. Okay, so just like that. And next I'm going to take the lightest shade in the Carly Bible Deluxe palette and put it underneath the brow bone, just to highlight a little bit. Okay, and then next I'm going to use this, um, it's Mally eyeshadow like a cream shadow and it's in the shade Saddle Shimmer. Just like that. And I'm just going to put that all over the eyelid. Use my little hand mirror. So I like to do one eye first and then blend it out before I start the next eye. So I'm just going to take um, my same blending brush that I used for the transition shades and kind of brush it off a little bit and blend the bronzy eyeshadow in the middle. So there's no harsh lines. This look is so easy. I can do it in like 10 minutes when I'm not 
recording. Okay, that's all blended out, so I'll just uh, do the other side now. Okay, so I got that part of the eyes done now, and now I'm going to um, highlight the inner corners. I'm going to take that white shade from the Carly Bible palette, the white highlight. First I'm going to spray my brush to intensify the sparkle. Okay, next I'm going to contour and bronze up my face using my Smashbox um, contour trio. I'm going to first go in with this smaller brush right here from Real Techniques and start to contour my cheeks. I make sure I really blend it back here into the hairline so no one can see the where the line starts. And then I will buff it out with a bigger brush. I'm going to use the contour brush from Real Techniques. This one. And just buff it out a little bit. And then I'll go in with the bronze shade in the middle of the palette. Okay, so I'll take a little bit of the middle shade the excess and just do an overall bronze and then I forgot to finish off my eyes but next I'm going to go in with the Stila Magnificent Metal um, Diamond Dust and I'm going to put it on the back of my hand just wipe it off on the back because I don't want it to be too intense on the eyelid because it already has a little bit of shimmer to it, but I just want to intensify it a little more. And then I'll dab it with, um, with my finger. And then I'll dab it over the center of the eyelid. You can see the difference here. As a little extra. There we go. So pretty. I love anything glittery and shiny. <laughs> okay, now I will go in with my blush. And then we will move on to highlighter my favorite part of doing my makeup. So now we can spray our face. I use the NYX Dewy Finish Veil. We will go in and highlight the tops of the cheekbones. Do the other side. Oh yes, it's so pretty, oh my goodness. I'll show you in a second which um, shades I used. I used the Carly Bible palette. This is my favorite highlighters in this palette that I've ever used. My nose, a little bit on my lip. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, so I'll show you the colors that I used for the highlight. I used, um, this one is the more bronzy highlight next to the pink shade, and then I went in with that white as well. And then last I'm going to go on to my mascara.
And then for lips, I'm going to use the Lipland uh, Liquid Lipstick in Spotlight. And this is how the finished look turned out. I'm happy with it. It's I think it's so pretty and it was so easy to do. Oh, the highlight is just gleaming. <laughs> so pretty. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this look, don't forget to like and subscribe. Comment down below. I would love to hear your feedback. And I'll see you next time. Thank you.